Yo, here we go. We are going to kick off a new uh, test session. We got two characters, level zero. We got full rest. We got the Dark Moon Fair going on. Need help? We're going to go to the Need fair. Help? We're going to get the buff. And we're going to spend one hour playing the game. We're going to exhaust well, all the rested experience and the buff and see how far we can get. And we'll see how long it takes to get from 0 to 40-ish with this garrison method. I think we can get there and uh, I think when I did the math it was between 3 and 4 and a half hours of active gameplay. The rest comes from uh, mission tables. One click gold. Do your mission tables and gain experience. Once we get to about level 40, then we can call that a day. And they will level from 40 to 50. Just straight up from mission tables. I don't need to do any more active leveling on them. Oh, hello. Mm, where do I buy tickets? I buy them right here. Again soon. Right. This should take us to Trade District. Good. Are we in time? I think we're in time, uh, time walking. Yeah, we're in time off, time walking. So we're gonna just start. So when I created this character, I brought them into Stormwind. I got time walking. I put my Hearthstone at the Trade District, and uh, that was it. I put the spells on my weapons. Outfitted my heirloom items. But I didn't do any gameplay. I just sat here in the, uh, and gained all the rested experience. 30 bubbles, rested experience, full rested, full dark moon. Let's do this. How fast can we go? Two fifty. We want to make sure we grab our profession on the way out. Herbalism. You grab an herbalism node and it counts for about a quest worth of experience. Five creatures worth. It's really good. Looks like I haven't set up my bar. We're not going to skip the intro quest because the intro quest gives you a Clear boatload of experience. Skies. And when we're doing active leveling, you need that experience. Just make sure you get the Dark Moon Fair and the rest of buffs. So you don't want to be doing too much active leveling over so many characters. There's a node right there. Missing it. It's not worth it. This area kind of is rough. You gotta just run through it. Those roots and those stuns are not sweet. Dismount is not sweet.
are also going to level up the alchemy when we get there. You want to get to level 30 so that you can get flying, so that you can fly in Pandaria. Until then, it's not really important. Keep your guard up. The inscription, however, you can learn right when you get to uh, Storm Shield in Ashram. And you can start doing your daily craft on that. on auto loot it's kind of silly that you have to do that every new character <laughs> like why isn't that automatically on <laughs> it's silly how far can we get in an hour uh i'm gonna say like level 21 us as conduits to power their portal. They will regret that. The shadow Did this once uh, last week, the week before, with the 50% buff. That was pretty sweet. But I wanted to record this without that buff because we don't usually get that 50% buff and I want this to be a little more useful. Doesn't make sense to record a video that is only only useful for about a week and a half while that buff is going on. I'd rather this be a little more vanilla. What's that guy talking about? Goldan? He's freaking out. I'm doing this Mechanome first. Allied Race starts at level 10. And uh, I'll do Pandarian next. Pandarian's rest experience goes up double. So I'll be able to do that much faster. Come back in one Vanguard is falling. We will not let their Much faster is in like be in vain. Quicker. It'll take half the time to do the next video for the panda. So I might as well start with this guy. In here. There is much we can learn. We cannot stay here long. Soon, the Make sure you grab these couple of quests on here on your way out. Our champion will stay back and disrupt the enemy camp. The rest of us will seek safe passage through the jungle. Fight well, friend. I require a target. I do not have a target. I require a target. Oh, I wish I had a speed boost. Too far away. Oh, they were bleeding us dry. I don't think we had much longer. These leapy orcs leaping on roofs. Probably teenagers. I need to target something first. What are they running for? Two, 
four more orcs. Should be able to get that up here. DK is good for AoE, and with your heirloom Whoever items, you, you should are. have a lot of automatic Thank health self-healing, which is Thank pretty good at Frost as well. Exactly remember which ones of these I use. <laughs> I'm not a professional, I just do this for fun. Observe and reflect. Where do we stand? How goes the fight? Hmm. Gotta use the AP. Makes it so much easier. Just click. Auto turn-ins. So good. Really changes the game. Makes us much more tolerable. We will escape before they can complete their transformation ritual. <laughs> it looks like Kadgar and the rest are on the move. Our work is nearly done, champion. Hey, the tree mount. I don't usually see this. <laughs> ah, it's too big? Oh my god. I may feel like get annoyed by the mount that I never see. These act speak birds are really good to tame for hunters. They give you a speed boost to running, which is excellent. You're gonna want that. Knowledge is power. At least I wanted it. First we deal with the bridge. <laughs> now, let's get moving. There is much we can learn here. Hmm. Stay alive, friend. Two levels already. I that item is still recharging. Down. What is happening, Exxon? We have a visitor. Perhaps a savior. We are freed. Follow me, Shadow. You can actually hit that fire Escape over the, the wall there. It's a little sneaky spot. After doing this 40 plus times, figure out some things. 40 plus times. Wow. The dead wow. To those who listen, there is much we can learn. We cannot hide here forever. Follow me and stay close. This area, you can take the break. You can sit on top of the uh, caster. Now. And this just AFK and it'll auto-complete. We'll Other players will complete and NPCs will complete at about the same rate as Nothing if you're killing as well. Hmm. So, you can definitely hang out here. You know what? One of these guys will hang out. This guy will hang out. And then the panda, I will be active. And we'll take a look at the difference. You will either leave it as victors Dump test. Or as corpses. 
Now, kill your hundred or die trying. Number just goes up. If you sit right on top of him, these guys don't aggro you. Obviously, I wasn't there yet. I don't see any other players killing things, so. I think we're doing okay. Yeah, we're the only one in here. Take this time to get a water, get a coffee, go to the bathroom. You can do whatever you want. prediction is that these actually complete at the exact same rate whether you're active or not but it'll be nice to actually have that recorded and defined I'm gonna have to kill this guy One, one guy makes a difference in the test. I'll be so sad. So sad. but we don't have that kind of time. That's right, Cadgar. We don't have time. Everyone, with me. I only counted ninety-nine kills, Wither. Then I guess we owe you one. After them! Don't let them get away. Quickly into the cave before they thaw. We will find Sark Maladar. Take Kiana with you and Street collect all the quests because they're all kind of tied together in the same trajectory. last time I did this is you can go up the stairs and drop in to pick up that corpse downstairs I am saves you a very small amount of time if you don't remember to do that which I mostly don't it's not that big a deal we get an epic loot dude This sounds too loud. Let's try that. It's just too epic. Too epic. Who's there? Oh, I'm glad I'm, we must hurry. These Shadow Moon orcs are under the command of Nerzo. That looks better. With his commander's looks aid, better. I don't know if it sounds better. Come looking for us. I don't know. Ugh, this guy feels slow after clearing all those hunters. <clears throat> Trying 
tragic. I think I just killed the guy. I must get closer. Pop him, pop him. minutes 42 minutes of bump left I'm not leaving without the others come on man I would forfeit my own this acolyte and I will retrieve the rest of our group do everything in your power to stop that orc from opening that portal we will make a marvelous sacrifice What is this? Movement speed? Don't need it. Not PvP in. some reason this area t feels like it takes forever to clear these quests doesn't it? it just feels like it that guy that carries a bunch of spears he drops like I think five weapons he spawns over here in this corner this is the best corner to collect those spears man That was open. I didn't even see it open. I focused. What's this? What's going on down there? What news <coughs> come from? My brothers and sisters, we will bring justice to our death by sending you three. Follow our champion onto the battlefield and listen for my call. I have a plan. Maybe this this quest specifically takes forever. I always run over here into the middle. Punch these giants. We are yours to come in. Just tag a bunch of things. Make sure that the NPCs are around. Pop the cooldowns. Just kill them all. It's not that hard. Tags. I like I it. Closer. Doesn't really matter if you pick up this loot, so it's garbage anyways. I am out of range. 
see this nerd back here. I, I've never come back here. I always catch this guy on the way out. I don't know what I'm doing. Getting all confused. Catching the guy on the way out? It's way better. Self-heal. Self-heal's probably a little bit better anyways. That's it. AP will automatically cancel those uh, epic moments of video time. Cutscenes, I guess they're called. I guess, I don't know. Tag all these dudes. There's a uh, some quest item that we need from these guys. I don't remember what it is, but there's something. I am out of range. I do not have a target. Uh, am I supposed to go in here? Oh yeah. Oh, that's why. X is not supposed to open my bags or rune forging. I require a target. Weird. Oh, I just put rune forging on the bar. Shouldn't have done that. That's why. User error. I need to target something first. And we need those schematics. What's going on here? Killed like seven of these dudes. I do not have a target. Wow. I didn't know that you could explode these bombs and just one shot those guys. That's super handy. <laughs> Wish I knew that 40 characters ago. Oh my god. I screwed that up. I screwed it up. What? Now go. <laughs> Free at last. I swear by the spirit. Pecadomes look great on these little discs. Disc mounts. Discus. Thirty minutes above still. 
Turn okay. Observe and reflect. Fire away. You do the fighting, and I'll do the fixing. Now, let's get up on that tank. Guess that's it. Let's carry on. Climb up those chains. Mm. I'm overthinking this. Is that guy shooting me? Do I care? Nope. Try not to fall off this chain. Sucks having to go back and do it again. Have you seen the wrench anywhere? Hops off the starboard bow! Looks like we arrived just in time. I'll see if I can get this. Hop into that turret! Keep him away! We will do what we can, Thalen. Hero, keep these orcs off of us. There's a couple of choke points on this. There's one right here that comes out here. And this path comes up and around. 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 So right here is really where they all converge. So as long as you're clearing out that spot, you'll maximize your... Uh, kills you can also double click this if you're fast enough and shoot two sure two is better than one right i think these take three shots yeah, three shots hold strong everyone here they come. Just make sure you're rotating between the creatures and the tanks. And the bomb baskets, whatever those guys are. Is this Lord of the Rings? We playing Lord of the Rings right now? I don't know if you can lose this. I wonder what it looks like when you lose. Not willing to miss the uh, five minutes of buff that that would take. Don't you give up yet, Paladin? This is not a threat. I don't think you can lose this. Just keep shooting. <laughs> You'll win. Now. Go 
Head for the ships at the end of the road. This way. Go! 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 There is no place to run, outsiders. This 27 minutes left. We will find you. 21? Mm, I don't know if we're going to make it. Oh, we're definitely not going to make it. The rest experience is almost out. That's okay. We're going to exhaust the hour worth of time. Let's get underway then. We will need to build a stronghold. You gotta be careful with this guy. Sometimes if you select it and you run up fast, too fast, he doesn't follow you. He bugs out. So I always wait till he gets on his silly mammoth mount. What is that thing? Ugly baby mammoth. Once he gets on that, you're good to run up. Prophet, I must warn you. The Iron Horde intends to strike out against all who oppose them. We must prepare our defenses. We will deal with one problem at a time. First, we must settle your people. It's coffee. Once I get done with this test, I'm gonna have a coffee break, and then I'm gonna do the panda. We're gonna do double testing today! Then at the end of the week, we're going to actually do the uh, second session after getting the rest buff up for five days. The panda will be 100% and the mechanome will be close. Doesn't have to be perfect, right? Missing like a couple days of rest, I think. I don't know. We'll see. We'll definitely be doing the panda a second time in this one week. The we've chosen represents the very best of the alliance. All right, come on through. Steady, steady. This is it, boys. Let's break some ground and take this world for the alliance. We can do it a second time and then a third time. So you could actually get them up pretty much. Just say the word, Commander. Interesting. I didn't think about that. So it takes about three hours of active gameplay. I have a feeling it's going to be a long night. Ready to work. I must get closer. It's kind of excellent that you can get him almost all the way up. I guess it matters that I only have <clears throat> that I only have one character, two characters that I'm leveling, and I'm not doing the, do the bulk. If I was bulk leveling, I would just do one. I wouldn't be able to do three back-to-back -back sessions, so I'd be spreading that over three different characters. But if you only do one at a time, I guess you could technically get a panda up in less than a month. That's crazy. something cursed ready to work i think i i would prefer spreading it over more characters because you get more missions done ready to work. and your followers will level up at a more normalized base instead of front loading your level that makes way more sense because you can only get you can only get a handful of uh, followers, one follower per week. And if you get your guy leveled up in a month that you only have four followers, it's pretty, pretty small. Orders, Commander. An excellent choice. No, just take it slow. Spread it over a bunch of characters. That's the best way to do it. But if you only have one or two to do, this is not bad. I'm also going to put some garrison resources on these guys, I guess. Juice them up so that I don't have to wait. Get them up to level 2 town hall as fast as possible. This 
guy's a little bit tough. Make sure to pop your cooldowns. Some of the characters have an easier time than others. But he's nuked a couple of alts. You know, we got two characters, so one character will rush, the panda will rush, and the mechanome we will take a little bit longer time to do. See what the difference is. I always forget to grab this quest. Let's grab all the quests and moving on. Hello, Commander. We'll get it done. My men are standing ready. How am I supposed to do this all myself? Where Keep do we together. stand? Be careful, I am out of range. If these pale orcs are real, <laughs> work. who knows what powers they possess? Light me with you. If you're doing it over a bunch of characters and you get to this point, it's a good point to take a break and stop because you can start generating those garrison resources once every three four five days log in and collect those on that character you're gonna need those to build out your garrison for sure King's honor Hello, Commander. Orders, Commander, for the Alliance. I feel so relieved. Maybe I can yeah. actually do What's some going stargazing on? tonight. That would yeah. be a nice change of pace. 20 minutes. So I always go in a certain way on this one. I always pick up this treasure in the water first. Then I go into that cave over there. There's another treasure in there. And there is uh, a bunch of quest items. Grabbing an Erp bow. I've never seen... How's it I've leveled all these characters and I haven't seen their arms turn into little... Uh, not rudders, not oars, the spinny things. Propellers. That's so cool. Mechanomes are cool. I don't know what you guys think. I don't know if I care. I think mechanomes are cool. You can just pull everything. It really doesn't matter. Drop the blip. What is that? Uh, that strike for auto healing. Couple of heirloom items for healing. You're not going to have a problem. Just AoE everything down. Smoke them. Pull them and smoke them.
Look at that guy. Doing the same thing. A little bit slower, buddy. I think that's the guy that I've been racing this whole time. Trying to keep up. Uh. Grab this little treasure. Treasures equal experience, so might as well pick them up. Over here, dude. What are you doing? I am I do not have a target. All set. Let's get back in. Let's turn these in. Let's carry on to the next group. Quest group. Cluster. Quest cluster. If you go in the cave, you don't have to mess around with those forest goblins. Silly forest goblins. So they don't spawn fast enough. The cave is full of dredge claws. Or what are, what are those things called? Claws. Dredge claws. Claw dredge. I require a target. I don't know. The cave. Go to the cave. Anyways, go to the water. Get the treasure. Go to the cave. Just kill things. My men are standing ready. Ugh, Come, some of these supplies are really water dangerous. Water. Hopefully, Sticky. this is the last. These we will see get the job them. done. Truly, this is disgusting. Barracks look fantastic. You should go check in with Murad. I'm going to hang out here. And oh, I love it. My Azeroth autopilot AAP. Just auto canceling everything. Goes it's so nice. Just Probably why I'm that faster than that one guy. Quite eager to explore this new land. All right. Let's clear some of these quests down here. Still got a little bit of rest. Still got 15 minutes. Looks like it might be right on time. full rest one hour grind session with one hour dark moon fair buff that's the best way to do it most efficient way and i ain't got time to be inefficient i ain't got time to be inefficient the demon's lair we'll capture it together the priestess of the moon also has something to ask of you dude over here you don't even have to get off your horse watch this just gonna grab her save her move on save Come out of there This is super useful for the heavy hitter creatures. Oh, two herbs over here. Should be about 1200, 1300 experience. 600 weak. I don't remember what that is, but I'm going to learn that. Let's see how much 600 experience is on the bar. Okay, half a bar of experience for just one herb? Come on now. Come on now. Just do it. It is unfortunate when you get attacked like that. Sneak attack, sucker punch right in the back. Just trying to get my half bar free experience, man. Come on now. I wasn't trying to aggress. I must get closer.
target something cursed. I cannot attack that target. You don't have to go crazy out of your way for the herbs. If they're in your path, grab them. If they're not, don't worry about them. Is that the guy I was racing? How'd he get in front of me? It's not possible, right? Oh, that's a warrior. all these people leveling like I'm leveling wow wow dead game living game living dead game living dead game I'm not a dueler. Come on, man. Ain't got time for that. I'm here to quest. I got 10 minutes of buff going. That's probably why there's people leveling. Is they're using the Dark Moon Fair. Dark Moon Dark Moon Fair, <laughs> dark moon fair buff. <laughs> well done. I'll take it back to the outpost and see that it's secure. Come. Dark Foon Mare. Bunch of herbs on top of that cave. Not gonna worry about it. I like to turn in these quests and do this later. It's a little bit faster that way. Because you run past that quay, that cave after you kill all the orcs anyways. So if you're gonna run past it, you might as well clear it then. I need to target something first. Eighteen. Easier to guard you if you stayed out of sight, Cadgar. I am not a child to cower beneath your cape. Be wary. I Too suspect scary. the stones will be heavily guarded. All right.
Oh my goodness. Everybody pile on, why don't you? This is all because that one guy blew up his stone and knocked me into all these nerds. My goodness. I must get closer. Can go down this hallway, grab all these toads, kill all these toads. We thought you was a toad. Was this? Oh my goodness, I forgot about that one over there. Five minutes. We're counting down. 21 versus 18. The 50% buff made a big difference. Shocker. Shocker. All right, we're going to wrap this up. We're going to turn in these quests. We should be about out of the five minutes. And that'll be an hour's worth of game time. And we'll be sitting at 18. Close to 19. First session. Good with that. We got the garrison up. We're going to be collecting resources. We're going to put this guy back in collecting rest. And we're going to collect Dark Moon Fair buff again. Then once he's full rest and Dark Moon Pair Buff is still up, I will do another session. See how far we can get the next session. I think the Panda can get full rested buff in the middle of the five day period of the fair. So that one will just rush. This one will can take our time a little bit. Then we'll be able to compare. We'll see the full journey for both characters. See the total play time on those characters? Should be look good. You could continue questing until you get to Storm Shield to get your um, inscription started. We will find a way that makes a bit of sense to me. But I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna just gonna use the full buff. You're right. You're not going out there. See this quest. Once you complete this quest, you can come over here and get this quest on the way out. You know what? Where's my garrison Hearthstone? We are going to fly over to Storm Shield. 
I do want to start the daily crafts. Daily one click? Come on, man. You know I'm going to do it. You could wait till the quest takes you out there because the quest will take you out there too. You pick up a follower, bodyguard follower, dwarf. Eventually gets replaced with uh, extreme scavengers from the Lunar Inn. Lunar Fall Inn. No time for dallying. Take me over to Storm Shield. We're just gonna just gonna do some inscription. Get that one click. We exhausted our hour. We're gonna take an extra five minutes. We're gonna come over here and do this. Cause I think it's worth it. I mean it's definitely worth it. It's gold. It's free gold. It's one click. Daily free gold. Come on now. That looks good. Next session, we'll go out here, clear, clear these orcs. Come down here, clear this. Go up and around here. There's some more quests to do. Takes us over here. Takes us down here. Takes us down here. And we should be close to level 30. And then on the third session, we will go over to Spires of Iraq. Iraq? <laughs> the Spires of Iraq. And, uh, to pick up the quest to unlock the salvage yard and we're going to go through the quest to get the uh admiral taylor <laughs> the admiral taylor is the free um follower that has inscription on him so you can plug him into your scribes quarters and get extra work orders done that's in session three session three should take us up to close to level 40 and uh we'll see where we're at at that point but as you can see, it's about 10 levels per hour long session. And I, I think it's going to be about the same. So we're going to carry on. Commander. See you later. Oh, that's kind of cool. We can just turn this stuff in while we're out here. We'll pick up that follower right away. Don't make it your home. It's a terrible idea. You bring news? Mano Ekta, my friend. I'm gonna go ahead and pick up that inscription right now while we're up here. Hello. Train me. Hey there. Give me the recipes. Oh, 
What do we got here? Where is it? War paints. Descriptions up and good to go. Did I join this guy into the guild? Yeah, I did. I'm also going to take him and grab some supplies for inscription. I guess you could count this against active level timing if you want. We are turning in all these quests at Storm Shield too. All right, well, it's a little bit over an hour, but we're still full rested. So, follow me. That's all you need to do out here. Oh, it's not all. You want to make sure you pick up archaeology. And then this guy will come back out here when I want to get uh, our uh, alchemy. Got to got to come out here to get the uh, alchemist stone. Get that at level thirty so that you can fly. You need the flying to get out to Pandaland to get to the alchemy trainer. Just makes it much easier. Take this guy back to uh, Stormwind. I'm going to grab the supplies and start his one-click gold method. Oh, the biggest mount. <laughs> Is that my only favorite ground mount? I don't know. Let's take off alchemy. Take off that. Take off alchemy engineering. I just want cerulean pigments. Let's restock them. Okay. I don't have a gnomish army knife. So let's get that too. Then this guy will be done for the day. Panda experiment coming up next. I'm going to buy my own items because I don't really care. <laughs> Failed to buy? Come on, man. Doesn't let me buy my own items? This is ridiculous. All right, we'll call it a day. This is done. This is done. This is not done. I gotta get the buff. Light I'm not a professional. I'm just doing this for fun. Light bless you. Shoot. Okay. I guess I didn't need to get the buff. I just need to get it before the week is out.
you doing? All right. That's that. This is just a dude gaming. Ouch.